I have to start by saying the jury reached this verdict deliberating only four and a half hours. You know that is never a good sign for the defendant. For some context, even the Bernie Madoff trial, it took them four days to reach a verdict. Now, he has been convicted on all seven counts of fraud, uh, money laundering, conspiracy. Right now, he is facing up to 110 years in prison. That doesn't mean that he will necessarily get 110 years, but that is the maximum sentence for the charges he's been convicted on. He will have a sentencing date that is scheduled now for March 28th. Now, remember, he had his bail revoked, so right now he has been behind bars during this entire trial and the period leading up to it, so we have not confirmed if he will remain behind bars, but if the status quo remains, he would until March, that sentencing date. I also want to highlight there is another uh, trial scheduled for March 11th. The government has not confirmed whether they plan to go forward with that or not. I mean, realistically, he was just convicted on all of these charges, so they will certainly have to consider whether they continue pursuing that case. But there are a couple of things that I, I want to frame up for you. Color inside the courtroom, he did not look at the jury, or rather he looked at the jury, but the jury did not look at him when they were walking into the courtroom. He was stoic, had no emotion when the verdict was read, but his parents, his mom had her head in her hands. His dad was hunched over uh, hearing the verdict, knowing that this now impacts potentially the rest of their son's life. And, you know, we were all wondering, would he testify and what would that look like? And from being inside the courtroom, our producer giving me the color, that could have been the nail in the coffin because you saw two Sam Bankman Freeds on the stand, one that was happy to answer questions when it was his own friendly questioning from defense and one who couldn't remember anything, an MIT grad that couldn't provide answers to simple questions.